Xenonism here. Welcome back. Let's play Assassin's Creed 2. Last time, <laughs> well, we did two Assassin's Tombs, and... Eh, not much else. Actually, no way. I'm wrong. Uh, we found La Volpe! And thanks to finding La Volpe, we know what Francesco Capazzi wants. We can do this, 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 and then here, because there's no point. So let's climb, climb, climb. The peasants are not allowed up here. But you didn't see it. Say your prayers, Cuninari. Master, don't lose him. You're going to lose me. So let's go get the codes of the pages, then probably visit Leonardo to get, see if I can get some more health. And after that... A murderer! <laughs> Stay back! Uh, Insomma. Please, my... I'm just a man. No one shall know true peace in this città. Do not think for one instant that this insane. Podetti mei omaggi a Madonna Giulia. We the Now, disturbing the peace in my presence. Ecolo, get him! Are you capable of thought? Or is he yes, I am capable of thought. No one is safe Where is anymore. the killer? He'll be after me next. Huh? No, not here. Not hiding here. Oh no! Help! 
still rather you than me. Life is short, so love the one you've got. There's always dead in this godforsaken place. Oh. Did I actually already enter this? Oh, memory is unavailable. That's just a nice little bit. They actually love where you bet. Yeah, no. You may well come back here later. We really do. Oh. Hear that? Oh, more the call me Donna. <laughs> That'll make the next mission a bit easier. <laughs> Must be a drunk. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I suppose it wasn't intentional. What's wrong with you? What is he doing? I'm not playing with you, Stronzo. You only get just so last month of his country, but before I had a lot of bad. Leonardo. Leonardo. Ezio, so good to see you. How can I help you? Haha! -ha! You found another one. How exciting! Is this an inverted Caesar shift? If I just substitute these letters here, I've got it. Codex Cypher. One health square gain. Special health. Because you are not going to be buying armor. Look at Francesco the Pazzi. There's Lorenzo and his wife. There's Giuliano, Lorenzo's brother. But where is Francesco? There he is. Time to strike. Crespa! Traditore! Giuliano! No! No! In nome di Dio! Mi scongiuro, pietà! Nessuno ha pietà! Oh. 
Sei in pessima forma. Dovresti fare più pratica. Your mama can't help you this time. You will pay for that. You saved my life. It's nothing. But the man who did this to you has to pay. Ah, not now. I need help first. To my home. Uh, people I trust. Uh, can you... Ah. And now we're on our first on me. escort mission. Escort Lorenzo I'm losing a lot of blood. Hang on, signore. I'm moving as fast as I can. Francesco De Pazzi! I'll kill him. I'll wipe his entire family from the city. There'll be a race! Quietatevi, signore. Conserve your energy, or I'll be delivering a corpse. We're almost there now. Lorenzo has been wounded! Aprite la porta! What's the password? Poliziano, open the maledetta porta! By the Christ greatest, come in, quickly! The city is at war! Hurry! Wait. I am in your debt. Tell me, why did you help me? You are not the only one who lost a brother to the Pazzi. My name is Ezio Auditore. Ah. You're Giovanni's son. Your father was a good man. He understood honor, loyalty. The Pazzi thugs are storming the Palazzo della Signoria. We cannot hold them off much longer. No. If they get inside, they'll murder our supporters and put their own devils in power. Then my survival would mean nothing. I have to... Uh, uh. Francesco de Pazzi. Help save our city, Auditore. Kill him. And now... Signori, I saw Francesco lead a battalion around the back of the Palazzo della Signoria. I fear he may be seeking another way in. Go, before it's too late. Do what you can! Farewell, Francesco. Now, gun storm. The city is now in chaos, but the man is not going to care about us unless we're up on the roof. Once we clear this, both red soldiers are going to be replaced by Medici soldiers. They're going to be a bit more lenient for cause to find them. But that doesn't mean that the Medici will not try and kill us. <laughs> Even here, if we attack a Medici soldier, they will try and, try and murder us. Understandable, considering we attack them. Even if we're on the same side, it makes sense. Go and try and defend them themselves from us and an attacker. <laughs> so, try and be careful where you strike. Let's climb up. Again! Why aren't you dead? Men! Slaughter him! <sighs> Francesco. <coughs> Your men aren't gonna save you now. You will join your son in Vier. Bastardo! 
why Come on! That is all... Fascination? Fatti sotto! Yes, great no. coming. It's just us now. Maledetto che il diavolo ti porti! Stami lontano! Really? Did you get here to deal with my friend Jesse? You're not getting away. You will be sharing the fate. <laughs> Firenze will judge you for what you've done. It's over. It's all over. Meglio essere felici in questa vita e aspirare a esserlo nella prossima. Requiescat in pace.
want to at least do this, because this is not really a mission. When I was six years old, I fell into the Arno. I soon found myself drifting down and into darkness. Certain my life was at an end. Instead, I woke to the sound of my mother weeping. At her side stood a stranger, soaking and smiling at me. My mother explained that he had saved me. And so began a long and prosperous relationship between two families. Yours and mine. I am sorry I could not save your father and brothers. You have nothing to apologize for. I believe Jacobo de Pazzi played a part in their deaths. They attack on you as well. I need to find him. That coward fled before we could arrest him. Have you any leads? No. They've hidden themselves well. They? Jacopo was not the only conspirator to escape. If they work with Jacopo, they were surely involved in the plot against my family as well. Give me their names. Antonio Maffei, Archbishop Francesco Salviati, Stefano da Bagnone, and Bernardo Baroncelli. Bene. I will go and see my uncle. He has men stationed in the countryside. Wait. Before you go. A codex page. I took it from the files of Francesco Di Pazzi, seeing as he clearly no longer needs it. I've always had an interest in things of antiquity, as did your father. It is meaningful to me as well. Then consider it a gift. Che il Signore ci protegga. That's why we wanted it, because we wanted to do that. Pazzi conspirators. Or be a pet. No, we want to ignore those. <laughs> There's only two things we want to focus on. So the assassination contracts are actually kind of interesting. And at one point, I did. Want I've to marked do the Palazzo Medici on your map. In order to achieve 100% sync with Ezio's life, you should go explore it. But I threw it away because they take a while to actually complete altogether. Home invasion. What happened here? Signor Lorenzo! Lorenzo's currently indisposed. Hey, you're the one who killed Francesco de Pazzi. Get him. With pleasure. Hey. I paura. I intend to. Odio questi momenti di incertezza. Mi attacchi tu. Attacco io. Non amo che mi si faccia aspettare. Bring it on. Okay, I will peel the skin from you. Vogliamo aprire le danze. I can't be that. You will die. That will hopefully be the only encounter we ever face. 
this. Now, to get up, where is it? Ah, there it is. Just wondering real quick where it was. This is another test, except our reward is just a bunch of money, which we kinda do one. Because when we have that amount of the majority, we're going to be spending a lot. Fatty Soto. I'll cut you like a fish! Stavolta, tua madre non può aiutare. Suffer for that! Vieni a prendermi! It's a fight, Feso! Because we're not dealing with the top enemies, I'm not going to try and... Okay. Later on, you'll see me only be using the hidden blade because the hidden blade is the only thing that is worth using. Because... Sans is... Yeah, no. The other weapons just have the problem of they're not as... they don't have quick kill. Meanwhile, the Hidden Blade has a guaranteed quick kill of the counter kill. Which sucks, considering the later games actually fixed this. Because even though... even some of the strongest weapons do not feel like they do enough. I know I heard a noise down there. It's time to earn your Florence. I want half of you to search the courtyard, the other half come with me to check the chapel. Si, Capitano. Then we check the secret passageways. What about Lorenzo? By now, Lorenzo is already dead. They say that, but I have doubts on that. Of course, it's coming here with us. Damn! Oh, Cut him off! Because I expect it! No! Strike! Very slowly for that! Don't be shy! No! Can't damn it! Oh, get him on the we'll blind side! Yeah, that guy's gonna... <laughs> right now. It's a duel, Fesso! Coraggio! Oh, oh, the the Let's try it again. Avanti, Mr. Get che. Aspetti il permesso del capitano. What? You need your capos per. Is that even past the door? We want to go through the window. Oh, it's not a one. Nope. Ugh. Oh, soup! Let's finish this. No! I got so! You the ammo quest. So, no. Always try and finish fights quickly. No points having them installed on.
so now I might as well we start talking about the I know he I'm sure of it. He is known. Not you! Where do you think you're going? About the temple layers. I'm sorry, I just <laughs> I've got surprised that this guy managed to actually nice spot try. me because that's something that I've never seen before that actually caught me off guard. Especially if he actually managed to hit me and just knocked me all the way back down, which is not good, as you can tell. But yeah, uh, I will be doing all the Templar layers. I don't know if they'll be the one episode or not. Lorenzo! Porca vaca! Someone, find a way to get inside there! You heard him? You two, get the ladder! And this is one of the ones I usually ignore because... Yeah, well, getting those big guys to give me my... Getting me free medicine is good and all. I don't like What are we fight. doing with the ladder? <sighs> Lorenzo isn't coming out. <laughs> What's taking them so long? If you both weren't so loud, you wouldn't have heard us coming. Merda, you were the loud one. All of you, mind your own business and keep watch. It opened. Did you hear that? It came from the bedroom. Whoever opened it must be in there. There's an intruder in the bedroom! Go! Kill him! Uh, si, Capitano. Si. So if you kill them, I actually missed that cutscene. Interesting. You won't escape! Your mother! Your mama! Ugly whore! I don't like being all the angles. Say impact. Non c'è la fire. Alright. Might as well just kill those two now, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm worried. That might as well look good. Throwing knives! Oh yeah, we do have those. And medicine, which is good. Shame that they lost this unique thing from this game to the next. No joke, it just becomes a random chance for them. <laughs> No reward for killing them. So but then again, you have ranged options by that point, so understandably that might be the reason. Get back! Lower your sword! It's me! Ezio. Again you saved me. First they enter my church, now my home. I'll hunt them down. They won't come near you again. Look around you. This is one of my treasure rooms. You're entitled to take anything you wish from it, in thanks for what you've done. I trust my apartments are safe now. Yes, Signore. Thank you for this most gracious gift. I must go, but I will come to you again when all the Pazzi are dead. I, I will not forget what you've done for me. Buona fortuna. I believe the dialogue actually changes if you've actually killed the Pazzi. Which is actually interesting. If it doesn't, then it also makes sense. Granted, you can also come back when Ezio is much older. Because technically, Brotherhood End starts where two ends, so I'm not even kind of spoiling anything. Memory sick. Lorenzo sick. I 
And now we've got a ton of money to spend on the villa. Probably end up maxing out the villa before we even need to get to uh, the next area. And I mean the next area that isn't that we have been before. But words! Huh! <gasps> Plaza de Medici. Plaza Medici. Plaza de Medici. We will be back here. Before we're gonna get a lot of money back in the villa. And we'll start getting much more. Leonardo, which means I believe it's the next weapon upgrade. Come, friends, I fresh caught leeches today. Please move it before the evening procession of Santa Claus. Come, friends, the new minds are making of my little work. Ezio, thank God you're all right. This madness with the Medici and the Pazzi, is this why you pursued Francesco? Not exactly. Well, whatever your reasons, the city's safe again thanks to you. Now tell me, how may I be of service? Ah, another page. Aha, it's a similar cipher to the last one. This won't take long. Interesting. Hmm. Indeed. I see. It's another blade design for delivering poison. Can you build it? See, it won't take very long. I just need to find a way to hollow out the blade without sacrificing the... It's all right, Leonardo. Just do what you need to do. And we get arguably the worst blade upgrade. All done. I filled your blade with a bit of poison to start with. Should you run out, just visit a doctor. Poison? From a doctor? In high enough doses, that which cures can kill. I am in your debt once more, my friend. Anytime, Ezio. Anytime. <sighs> Poison Blade! Which, I don't know why it has no anything, but you'll never really see me using it. For one reason. One Big, big reason. It sucks. That isn't to say, say that it isn't useful. It's just compared to what the hidden blade can do on its own, the poison blade is vastly inferior. There's all it's only in one of the blades that you can't poison two targets at once. No! No! Stay away from me! <sighs> Thanks to these guys, I'm getting much more money than I thought I would. Spare me! Take what you want! But the big, the bigger issue is, you need to be right next to your target. Which also means, guess what? What the devil's got into you? The guards are going to have, have a high chance of noticing you. Even if you aren't near the guard when you've killed them, they'll probably notice that that you're nearby and still kill you. Been drink? Which is where the a shame, oh, him down, considering as a concept the poison blade is actually really cool. Brotherhood gave it two upgrades, which made it much better. First was the high was the deadly poison upgrade. I don't remember what it's actually called. Oh, yes, I am in the right way. The Deadly Poison upgrade... Oh, no, no. The Deadly Poison upgrade literally is what it says. The poison acts faster and it's... More to get 
the fact, the desired effect you want, which is a guard play, flailing around, hitting his own comrades quicker. But the other effect, the other upgrade is the one that I'm much more interesting. Which, which is much more interesting, which is interesting. Sorry, sorry. Leonardo yeah. never builds it, even though he implies he remembers the design. Hey, hey. Which is poison darts. Best upgrade in the series, but also the most broken because of it. I can't talk about how it works because it's a weapon that we haven't got. As the game has accidentally spoiled itself. Yeah, it's the pistol upgrade. Yeah. And there's also an assassin tube here. So I'm actually gonna do that this episode. Then upgrade it. Then do the upgrades, then end the episode. Yada yada yada. This one's actually quite short. The reward isn't as amazing. But hey. It's not it's not bad to have an easy mission. This is Effectively, it's now only in the Ezio Avatar collection. If you don't have the collection, you're probably never going to get this. So I don't know if it's on the PSN or Xbox shops. These are... Yeah. Oh yeah, Messer Marco Polo. <coughs> This is actually interesting because it does. <sighs> really? It's not there? No, it has to be. Oh, it's. Yeah, it was. It just wasn't working for some reason. Oh well. I'll put these on the screen for a while, but... Yeah. I'm not gonna keep it on for long. First time puzzle will be much later, but hey. Nope, I did not need to do that. We'll start again. Thankfully, it does allow me to show you what happens when you to reset. You don't need to wait, you can just go down and back up. Enjoy the beautiful cool cutscene where it does actually lose your two seconds. If you have timed it though that you don't need to worry about the cutscene. But if you feel like the cutscene that you're not as good or that you, you may need a little bit more time, you can reset it immediately.
This trick is actually something that we need to actually know how to do anyway, so must be tested on it. It's actually not a bad bad thing. Go for that secret area, but I'm not going to. This one is the real big test. This one's the test speed. Reflexes. Can you can get through this? Without worrying? I think I might mess up though. Which is okay. Yep, nope, I messed up. I need to climb up. My reflexes were not strong enough. Because it's the one move that isn't that used in Brotherhood, and I'm so used to playing Brotherhood as well. So, it's probably going to be seeing me mess up this one. This gets dark, so... I'm sure someone actually has the whole story up on their YouTube channel. But yeah, you'll see if you do all this in actual chronological order, it's actually really dark. Don't ask why I thought that was smart. I legitimately don't know why I thought that was a smart idea. But hey, at least I get a few extra seconds this time. Said, very dark. And there's money scattered out, not as much. It's all about lore in this place. Because there's only two. Oh, there's three. Oh, well, there's only two. So there's. Oh, there's actually four. I hit missed this one then. So there's only 2,000, which, yes, yeah, kind of sucky, especially since you'd think you'd get something, but you don't. Memory 
Saint, Family Crypt Explorers. And we get an extra 3,000. So we get, in reality, 5,000, which is pretty good, but not amazing. So... We only got one more thing to do. That's right. Head back inside <laughs> by taking a long way. We've got more money. Might as well take the chest while we're here. The extra money won't hurt. <laughs> there is actually quite a bit of chest with a lot of money in Monte Majority. So, if you find one, open it. I can faintly hear. I'm sure I have just what you need somewhere in the back, perhaps. Right, we have a bunch of stuff we want to put in. I'm actually going to put everything in to their places first before we take out the money because we might get some extra money while we're coming from the Assassin Tombs. Not assassin to the sanctuary. <laughs> Up by 30. Ezio! <laughs> come in, come in! To what do we owe the honor? First recorded makes sense. So we can see what she was actually the master of. Okay, so she is poison. <laughs> come in, come in. To what do we owe the honor? The tons of florins. Buongiorno. Salute, Ser Ezio. Shall we take a look at the list? Yes, we shall. Renovate the mines. Renovate the church. And now it's time to renovate the things that are going to be very helpful, like the blacksmith. I want to max that out, because we can then start paying for stuff at extremely cheap. We want to pay for the doctor, because that'll be extremely cheap. We want to pay for the tailor, because then that will be extremely cheap. Probably tell. And then we only have the bank and the art merchant left to max out. Buon we viaggio. almost maxed out everything. 
So, with Monster Jury's value skyrocketing, next time we'll go see Uncle Mario. Until then, this is Inu Nizuma signing out. <laughs>